Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Today will be a super helpful video to any of you having a Ford F-150 that generation between year 2009 and year 2014. If you guys have one of those, you need to find where the relay for the windshield wipers is located, guys. If your wipers do not work, check that relay. We'll explain where you can buy cheap relays from and why it's important to test fuses and relays. All that will be covered in this video today so we don't waste your time and money. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us guys. On this channel, you will find all the fuse videos on Ford F-150. We're going to make video for every single fuse. So if you're on the road, stuck in the middle of somewhere, you need to find a specific fuse, you can just come to the channel, search for it, find it in less than, let's say 30 seconds. You don't even need to pull your manual out of the glove box. And most of the times you will be even missing this one. Something else guys, uh, we, take cars here at the garage and we take them completely apart. We fix engines, transmissions, bodywork. We show you how to fix pretty much anything. And the mechanical work, guys, okay? Electric coats and things like that can be found on our main YouTube channels. Uh, those are all uh, our other channels. And this one is our new channel where we're going to share just fuses so we can make it really convenient for you to find the information that you need. Now, if you need to buy replacement fuses, relays for your Ford F-150, because do, those can be really expensive at the parts store or, or the dealership, check out the link in the description of the video below. That's where we get all our two supplies from and you can get them at a really good price and quick shipping as well. So let's continue. So we will demonstrate here on 2012 Ford F-150, but even if you have a different year, that generation, it may work as well. You also guys have fuse for your wipers as well. So check out, we'll have the uh, video about Ford F-150 wipers fuse location on our YouTube channel. So you can find more information. The glove box that we will need will be right under the hood. Above the radiator fan, you'll have a, rad uh, you'll have a fuse box right there. And if you open that fuse box, it will look just like that. You have the fuse uses and we can zoom in and show you clearly here now you will be on this side of the fuse box that will be towards the windshield side but let's explain why it's important to test fuses and relays now so let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses fuses not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good sometimes they may seem perfectly fine you think it's a good fuse you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do test your fuse find out it's bad replace it fix your problem so we will have a video how to test a fuse okay different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys we're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out you guys have only three different kinds of relays but these relays if you're stuck in the middle of nowhere they can cost you quite a bit of money or you may not be even able to find them so we recommend to keep some spares in the glove box just for a peace of mind we'll put a link in the description of the video below where you can see where you can get them from at a really good price and quick shipping as well the relay guys for the windshield wipers will be one two that second relay right here that's the one that you need to check guys uh, that relay right here hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time